Well, I was diagnosed with melanoma in um, December of 1993. Um, initially, I don't know that it still sunk in how important sun safety was, but in um, 1999, May of 1999, the melanoma had metastasized into my lymph nodes. And at that point, um, I was given a 50% survival rate chance for five years. Uh, at that point, sun safety became very important to me. Ultraviolet light that comes from the sun causes a fair amount of damage to our skin just over the lifetime. The changes in the skin that we see from sun exposure, usually it's from chronic sun exposure, long-term sun exposure. We see problems related to skin cancers and precancerous skin conditions. We see the lines and wrinkles that you, you see from sun exposure. Um, we see some color changes. You'll see freckling and a lot of sunspots that people will have uh, from sun exposure. I try to get patients first thing in the morning to apply some sunscreen. I wear sunscreen most every day. It's just part of my daily routine. I have uh, sunscreen in my truck as well if I need to re redo it during the day because I'm out and it's hot and I'm sweating. Uh, I put it on in the morning usually before I leave the house if I know I'm going to be outside all day. I wear long sleeve shirts. I wear wide brimmed hats. Uh, I also see my dermatologist every year. We see a lot of skin cancers, especially on outdoor workers, so I always encourage our, especially our guys, to protect their necks and ears. Forearms especially, we see a lot of skin cancers on the hands and forearms. I think most of the time we forget how much time we spend out in the sun. Uh, whether you're a district sales manager or a territory agronomist or a TDR, in the summertime our job is to be outside with customers, walking fields, walking test plots, making evaluations of products. And we spend a lot of time in the sun and we don't really think about it because maybe it's just in a brief 20 minute block and then we drive somewhere, but we're exposed to the sun. Uh, we also forget about the times that we're driving down the road and we're exposed when we're driving and, and we just don't even consider that. We know that even if you start later in life, it's, it's helpful. If we give our skin a break, it repairs itself to some extent and then maybe we can catch up and uh, that will help us prevent skin cancers for the future. Protecting my skin was so easy, didn't take a lot of time, and it could save my life. So that's probably when it became very important to me to uh, not only take precautions myself for sun safety, but my family, and then share the message with other people.